Hello, teacher. Hello, good afternoon. Hello, Kua. Good afternoon. <laughs> okay, now please put your camera a bit, a bit down. I can't see your face. That's it. You look so handsome. How are you? Mm, I'm not very good. Oh, why? Because I feel a little bit tired. Oh, why you're so tired? Because I have to do lots of homeworks. Oh, oh, homeworks. Okay, talking about homeworks. Your homework is very good, actually. Yes. <laughs> it's quite good. Okay, now uh, let's talk about the vocal boast. Okay, the compound adjectives. Okay, for you to understand more. All right, Kua? Okay. Now, when we say compound adjectives, this is an example. Three-headed monster. Okay, three-headed monster. That means it is a monster that has three heads. Okay? It okay. only explains. Okay, for example, another example. A man eating lion. It is a lion that eats man. Okay? That is compound adjectives, all right? Now, three and four, your answer is so fine. Yes, okay, that's correct. For example, your answer is five-story house, a house that has five story stories. Yes, correct. A million-dollar apartment is an apartment that costs million dollars. Correct. Okay, wow, good job, Kua. Okay, another is a well-prepared student. That means uh, is a student that is well-prepared anytime, okay? Okay. Okay, you're awesome, Kua, you're awesome. Okay, just if you have something to ask, Especially in our homework, just ask me in the group chat, okay? Okay. Oh, you're mute, Koa. Hey, mute, please unmute. Okay. Okay. Okay, thank you. All right. Now you're smart. Okay, you're smart. You're the smartest student I have. Okay, now, Koa, are you ready for our class? I'm ready. Yay. Okay. Now, have you taught this unit? Yes, no. I think it's no. Uh, good job. Okay, now please read. Solution Intermediate Unit 1 Generation Lesson 2 Grammar. Yes, we will focus on your grammar, okay? Okay. Okay, all right. Now this is your unit map. Finish vocabulary. Next is grammar. Past tense. Contrast. Use to. We are going to learn how to use the phrase use to. Okay? And past tense. All right, so for you to understand, let's go to the next page. Let's learn this, okay? Just a minute, go what? Ta-da! Okay, please read. Read all. Yes. 
Uh, now, this part first. This part up. We, we use past tense to talk about past events. We use the past continuous to describe a scene in the past. The events were in progress at the same time. Okay. Oh. And then, uh, then here the sun it was shining. Go. Please read. The sun was shining. The sun was shining. A man was standing at the bus stop waiting for a bus. Okay, now let's talk about the past tenses. Now we use, sorry, I can't see it. We use past tenses to talk about past events. For example, I eat mushroom yesterday. That means it's a past event, okay? Eat. The past, past tense of eat is? Eight. Yes. Okay, please spell. A-T-E. Yay, that's great. Now we use past continuous to describe a scene in the past. The events were in progress at the time. Now, for you to understand what is past continuous and past tense or past simple, please read. We use the past simple for actions or events that happened once after the order. Okay, for example, Tom got up. Look, got. Had a shower and got dressed. Got is a past tense of? Get. Yes, okay. So, Tom got up. It's already done. Got. Tom is already away. Tom got up. Had a shower and got dressed. It happens in the Future past. in the past. In the past. Yes. See, you're awesome. Okay, next. I want you to use and make a past simple sentence. Just one sentence. He came to the house, rang the bell, and... Knocked the door. Wow. wow. Your grammar is great. <laughs> okay, next two, we use, please read past continuous. We use the past continuous to describe a longer background event and the past simple to describe an action or event that interrupted it. Okay, for example, the phone rang while we are having dinner. See, the phone rang while we were having dinner. The phone, and they're doing something, right? That is past continuous. It is described longer background event. Oh, sorry. Longer background event, okay? There are two actions. Right? Wrong. And having dinner. Right? So longer. Longer event. Okay, Kua? Okay. That is past continuous. Now, and the past, simple to describe an action or event that is interrupted. That is past simple only. The man is them oh, for example i um, yesterday i cook banana pie so i cooked banana pie simple one action only right cooked the cooked that is only the action that is past simple 
While in past continuous, there are two actions. The phone rang. Action rang. Ta -da! <laughs> While we were having dinner. Having dinner is action too. Okay? Past simple. That is the difference of past simple and past continuous. Okay? Okay. Now your turn. Please make a sentence using past continuous. Uh. His mama called him while he was watching TV. Oh, bravo, bravo. Okay, good job, Kua. Now, ready to read past perfect. We use the past perfect to talk about an event that happened before another event in the past. Okay. I didn't have any money because I lost I lost one my wallet. Oh yes. Okay, thank you. Now past perfect to talk about event that happened before. I'd lost my wallet. This happened before. Right, Kowa? Now happened before and then another event in the past. I didn't have any money. Okay? Okay, one other example if you want to know, if you're confused. I don't have a job because the company has got bankrupt. Okay? Okay, your okay. turn. Past perfect. Uh, uh, again, past perfect is talking about an event that happened before i know just i'm just thinking oh i see <laughs> i didn't have any pencil because my friend took it Oh, very good. See, that is past. Perfect. Good job, Koa. Okay, notice that with regular verbs, the past simple and past participle form of the past perfect are the same. For example, again, notice that regular verb that means simple verb, regular verb. The past simple and the past participle form of the past perfect are the same. Look, she, oh, okay. Let me clear all the drawings. Oh, I can't see it. Just a minute. Okay, she arrived. She arrived yesterday night. When did she arrive? She arrived yesterday night. Yes. And next, first sentence, the second sentence. She arrived. She had. She had arrived. Please read. She had arrived before we served the dinner. Okay, before we served the dinner. So same yesterday night before we served the dinner. The dinner that means night, meal in night, right, Koa? So the same, right? She arrived before we served the dinner. And here, arrived, the same 
verb. Same, she the had same meaning. Arrived. Yeah, the same meaning too. She had arrived, the same verb. If the verb is irregular. Okay? Regular verbs, for example, these are the verbs we add D or ED. ED or D. Okay? Work. Work. Another example of regular verb, talk, talked, okay? Okay. Okay, we cannot say, for example, this is not an ir irregular verb, eight. Eight is not, a regu it's not regular, but irregular, okay? Okay. A regular verb is a verb that when we talk about past, for example, eight, the past of eight, it is eight. A, T, E. The spelling is change, right? In the past. Right. Yes, that is irregular verb. Okay, Kua. Okay, do you have a question if you're confused or something? No, I don't have a question. Yeah, that's me, Kua. Okay, however, irregular verbs, the past simple, please read the past simple. The past simple and the past participle from the past perfect are often different. Yes, they're different. For example, I, I ate, ate an apple. I've already eaten. Okay, I've already eaten. This is the past participle, right? And the past simple is I ate an apple. Okay? Okay, look. Okay. Eaten. Can you wait me a moment, please? Oh, sure. Came back. Yeah, hi. Okay. Now let's recall the, the this, okay? All right, let's go back to the beginning. Okay, now, Koa, I have something to ask. Is it okay? Okay. Okay, now past tense is... Past ten is uh is the uh, 
past tense is the event in the past, I think. Yeah. Yay! Very good, Koa. You learned fast. Now, past continuous is? I can past continuous to describe a longer background event. And the past simple to describe an action or event that interrupts it. Yay. Okay, thank you. All right. Now, here, this is an example of past simple, okay? Past simple is an event that happened one after the other, okay? Okay. Number, yes. Happened event one after the other. Got up, had shower, got dressed, okay? Okay. Okay, past continuous. What is past continuous? Past continuous to describe a long the background event. Yes. And the past simple to describe an action or event that interrupts it. Yes. Okay, the longer background event. The phone rang. How many actions in past continuous? Mm, uh, I think it's two. Yes. The phone one short and one long. Five. Yes. Okay. Very good. Now let's go to past perfect. What is past perfect? Past perfect is an event that happened before and another event in the past. Okay, so there are two events in past perfect, right? One, two event, And an event that happened before another event. So there are two events. That is past perfect. I didn't have any money because I lost my wallet. Lost my wallet and have any money, okay? Wait, I'm so busy. Oh, sorry. <laughs> okay, you're some, did you, you're doing something?
ko. What time is it? Good job. Hi, Kawa. Hi, Hichen. Okay, there's someone call you. Yes. <laughs> I see. Okay, let's go. Ready? I'm ready. Okay, for you to better understand what is past simple and past continuous, and past perfect, okay? Now, okay. in past simple, we use the subject. For example, oh, sorry. For example, to be. To be is our subject, okay? To be was, were, plus object, okay? Another, for okay. example, to be. To be were. Plus was a word plus not plus object. Was okay. a word plus subject plus object. Okay, all right. Now, how about please give me an example of this? Uh, he wasn't go. He wasn't go to the swimming pool. Okay, that's it. Very good. Now, how about the past continuous? Subject plus was a word plus verbing plus object. Yay, very good. Okay, now let's go to, oh, sorry. Okay. <laughs> okay. Let me hear. First subject plus verb, ET, okay. Go to be. Um, to be plus verb, ED, uh, what is P1? P1 or any sentence. Uh, for example, let me give you an example, okay? Okay. Okay. Now, example, Kua invited me the, for dinner or yesterday. Kua invited me yesterday for his, uh, just another, just a simple, simple sentence. Let me think of it. Okay. Another. Okay. Kua cooked pizza yesterday okay that's it okay now your turn um, okay. simple sentence mm -hmm. My mom is 
Hmm. My mom baked cake last month. Oh, see? That's great. Now here, let's talk about continuous, past continuous, all right? Okay. Okay, now the past continuous is subject was verb plus verb ing. They were cooking pizza yesterday. Okay, again, for example, they were cooking pizza yesterday. Okay. Now your turn. Okay. The children were going to the park. Yes, that's it. Very good. Bravo, Kua. Great job. So here, let's go to the past perfect. Please give me an example of this. Subject have, has, verb with ed, okay? Hmm. Mr. Brown has has a uh, has okay. baked Mr. cake. <laughs> Mr. Brown and has baked a cake. A cake. <laughs> See, very good. It's easy for you. Bravo. Impressive, Gua. Impressive. Now I want you to practice this okay 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 now we will go in oh this would be your homework all right uh i will make sentence and yes i will show you oh you'll show me in our next class okay 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 i will copy this uh, you're going to copy this or I'll send a picture for you. I'll send a picture in our group chat, okay? Okay, Koa. Okay. Okay, all right, let's go to the next page. Ta-da! Okay, let's complete the learn this. Please read. Complete the learn this box with the tense below. Then underline an example of each of the rules A to D in the text in exercise two. Okay, thank you. Okay, past tenses. Look, past tenses. Okay? Okay. Please. A. Please read. We use the for sequence of events that happen one after another. So this is past simple. Yes, past simple. Very good. You're great. Now in 1939, my parents met, fell in love, and got married. We used the to describe a scene in the past. What is it? Uh, past continuous. Let's look. Very good. Correct. Past continuous. Okay. It was raining and the people were rushing home from work. 
it was, the word was, raining. And the people were rushing from the fort. Please read. We use past simple. Past simple. Let's look. Yay. Okay, next. And past continuous. Number four. Yes. Correct. Okay, please read. We use. We use the past perfect for an event that happened before another event in the past. He had started a business before he left school. Okay, good job. Okay, let's go and talk about this exercise again. Okay? Okay. Okay, now we used past simple. When we use past simple? We use the past simple for a sequence of events that happens one after another. Okay, for example, this. This is an example of past continuous. Okay, past continuous, describe. Describe a scene in the past. The events were in progress at the same time. Okay, now this is an example of past continuous, okay? This. Okay. This is a past simple. Happened one after another, okay? Now, it was raining. See? Was. Subject, it. Was. Plus verb, ing. Past continuous. And people were. People is the subject. Were plus verb, ing. Rushing. Object, home from work. Okay, this is an example of past continuous. Now, past simple. What, when do we use past simple? We use past simple for a single event that interrupts a longer event in the past. Okay, okay, thank you. Now, when do we use past continuous? use the past continuous for the longer event. Yeah, it's for longer event. Okay, that means long, long. Okay, for example. My parents got. Sorry. My parents. How can I read that? Okay, my parents got. Can you see it, Koa? I don't know how to read it. Engage this one. Yes. Engage. There's a ring. Engage. My, my, my parents got engaged while they were living in Wales. Yes, in Wales. Now look, while, the word while, my parents got. Got is a past tense. My parent is the subject. Got past tense. Regular. Irregular verb and then engage. Engage. And then here they, subject, were leaving. Subject plus were plus verb ing, leaving, right? In Wales, the object. Okay, this is an example of past continuous. Okay, let's go back to the pa last page. Ta -da. Oh, sorry. Here, past continuous. Okay. Okay. Okay, all right. Now let's go. Oh. Ta -da. Okay, so are you ready to answer next activity? I'm ready. Okay, now previous activity, you're the best. Congratulations, Koa. Grammar is 
Excellent. Now let's go to task two. Please read. Complete the sentence. Complete the sentence in three different ways using three tense in the learn this box. Use the verb learn. How does the meaning change? Okay, use the verb learn. Now we are you are going to make a sentence using the verb learn. Okay. Three tenses. The three tenses. What are the three tenses? Uh, past simple, past continuous, and past perfect. Okay, good job. Okay, now here. When Tom left school, he learned how to drive. Okay, learn how to drive. Now using another tenses. The past continuous. Um, when Tom left school, he was learning how to write. Yay! Good job, Koa. Okay, very impressive. Okay, now here. Oh, sorry. Okay, now how about how about the past simple? Okay, please read he, this. Uh, when he, when Tom left school, he had learned to write. Yes, he had. We we add had. This is an example of past simple. Okay, now let's go back to. Okay, just a minute, I can't undo it. Let's go back, okay? What, to know what sentence is it? I just can't. Okay, have had, it is past. Past perfect. Yes, past perfect. Have has, have has, okay? Remember, have has, past perfect. Okay, Koa. Okay. Okay, okay. Good job, Koa. Ta -da, ta -da. Now, can you please give me one sentence using past perfect? Uh. When uh, when I uh, when I played in the park, it uh, it has already already rained. Oh, okay, very good, Koa. Okay, so our time is already over. Now in this lesson, you're great. You're a fast learner, Kua. Okay, wow. Now don't forget your homework, okay? This one. Give me an example for this, okay? Okay. Okay, now you're the best, Kua. Stay cool. <laughs> okay, bye-bye, Kua. Good evening. Bye-bye. Goodbye. Bye -bye. Goodbye.